I just thought that Saturday night was so absolutely kick ass. I, I was like, that is getting your money's worth from a pay per view. Uh, you know, 60 bucks, whatever it was. That was just absolutely worth the price of admission. Can you imagine being there live at the MGM for that? To pay a ticket to go in that gate, sit down and watch those last two fights. To see that Holly Holm dominating. She was up 3-1 easy. I mean, Misha Tate did nothing in that fight. And now she's the champion because she got her down on the ground and choked her out. Rear naked. And that was that. Uh, submission. I, I couldn't believe she got uh, taken down like that. And just literally manhandled on the ground like she put her in like a, a boa constrictor it was over and then uh she tried to uh hang on she almost passed out is what it boiled down to she almost went to sleep and then uh what i saw nate diaz do to conor mcgregor was so absolutely scintillating that was maybe the best sporting event you know, honestly, Mafia, that I've seen in this year, like in the last year. Like, what, what what was better than that? Tell me what was better than that. What game was better than that? Um, certainly not the Super Bowl that was totally dominated and ugly and filled with penalties and uh, no first downs and punts and absolute boredom. What sporting event was better than that? Watching the Warriors kick everyone's ass? What, what sporting event was better? What, the Daytona 500 photo finish? Does anyone care about that? Like, I mean, you have to, like, beg me to talk about it. What was better than that fight? I don't care what anybody says. Like, you may not even like the UFC, but that was so unbelievable watching that guy go heavy hands on Conor McGregor's face. Like, because he was getting his ass beat in the first round. He took some shots to his eye. That Diaz fight, the first round was, was just violence. And the second round was absolutely even more violence. I was blown away completely by that uh, fight. 